having small kids at home can be a tough but rewarding job. And sometimes moms could use a little support. Happening in your community, it's a magic show benefiting moms and preschoolers, otherwise known as MOPS. And the Tuscola MOPS co-coordinator Katie Titus is here as well as fundraising coordinator Kristen Craig. Welcome, ladies. Thank, Thank you. you. Okay, let's talk a little bit about the Tuscola MOPS group and kind of what you guys do. So we are a moms group. Um, we're called Mothers of Preschoolers, but we serve all moms. And it's just, we meet once a month. Um, we have hot breakfast, free childcare, and it's just a time for us to have fellowship and connect with other moms that are going through the same season of life. Those are two things that are very hard for most moms to find, right? Yes. Hot breakfast and free childcare. Yes. Um, I'd say impossible. You know, what, what do the meetings look like? Is, is this just like, um, therapy for each other <laughs> or you know do you do fun things like how does it all so happen? this year our theme is have more fun mm -hmm. fear less and find your people so we're focusing on those aspects and so our meetings are usually themed around one of those lines and so what we'll do is we'll get together we have breakfast we usually do a fun activity mm -hmm. um we'll have like a little um show that we'll watch yeah. or we'll have a little lesson presented by someone. I think this month we're going to have Pastor Terry um, of the United Methodist Church in Tuscola is going to speak to us about prayer. Mm -hmm. And so and then we'll um, have a discussion time and get to actually talk to each other without kids interrupting. <laughs> and <laughs> yes. so, yeah. Why do you feel it's important for moms to participate and get involved in this kind of group? Having young kids and especially being a stay-at-home mom, it can get lonely even though you're, you know, you're with your kids but you're also not with adults as much. So it's so nice to connect with other moms who might not always let out those feelings that we have in those group discussions. You know, they can let it out and find out that a lot of us are going through the same things. Yeah. It can be a very isolating experience, mm -hmm. I would imagine. Talk about the uh, the magic show that you guys have coming up here soon and who it's geared toward and how that's all going to play out. So in September, our leadership team of um, our group, we went to Orlando, Florida for MomCon, which is a conference um, for MOPS members. And for moms, all moms. Yes. It does, you don't have to get MOPS members. Yep. Right. And it's all about um, faith and motherhood and marriage, and there's workshops on all kinds of things. Um, and the MC there was Taylor Hughes. He's a um, Christian comedian, magician, storyteller, and he's a bit of a musician too. He can play the ukulele <laughs> and sing songs. Yeah. Um, and we found out that he was going to be local. Um, this month, so I reached out to see if we could host a fundraiser with him, and he got back with me, and it's happening. That's exciting. <laughs> yeah. So it is a fundraiser. Yes. So it's happening December 12th at the Tuscola United Methodist Church. Is this bring the whole family out yes. and enjoy this kind of Absolutely. magic show? Absolutely. When we talked, he's like, oh, we can do a mom's night out or we could do a family night out. I'm like, I absolutely want it to be family friendly. So it's fun for all ages, whether you're bringing kids or not. Well, we do want to mention that seating is limited. Yes. So you need a ticket. Yes. How do we go about getting those? Um, you can visit the website that we're selling those on. It's uh, TuscolaFamilyNightOut.TicketLeap.com. Okay. Will he make the terrible twos disappear? Is that like a magic act we can pull we off? We wish. <laughs> we do wish. Yeah. Absolutely. Can anyone be, become a member of your MOPS group there in Tuscola, or how does that work? Any the, mom. Mm -hmm. Yes. Any mom, mom can... Um, that wants to join or we're always looking to, for volunteers that want to help with the kids as well. That's true. <laughs> um, and we have mentor moms that sit with our tables. Um, they're older and have been through our season of life and they <laughs> yes. give us advice. It's amazing. Um, but we meet once a month, um, the second Thursday of every month from 9 to 11. So if they want to come, they can just show up and then yeah. Um, talk to us about joining. Awesome. So great to have these opportunities for young moms or moms of any age to uh, network and get yes. together and have some fellowship. Absolutely. So cool. Thank you, it's going to be a great Appreciate magic it. show, too. If you want to look at uh, the MOPS Facebook page, well, there it is right there on your screen. <laughs> Funny how that works. We will connect you to them on our Facebook page as well, and hope you will check that out.